So my last video was about relays. I've said you needed to add a diode. Let me show you exactly what a diode does. Stay tuned. All right, so this is a diode. This is actually a three amp diode. Normally in most car audio applications, we only use this small one, which is a one amp diode. They also make six amp diodes. The main use for a diode in car audio is to isolate one circuit from another. So right here I have a diagram of a diode. We have an anode and a cathode. Now 12 volts can only pass through one way. I always try to remember AC power. So anode to cathode will transfer power. Now negative would be cathode to anode and then you could transfer ground this way. If you try to transfer power from this side, it will get blocked by the diode. If you try to transfer ground from this side, it will get blocked by the diode. Let me show you exactly what I mean. Once again, I'm going to break out a test light. So right here I have grounded my test light on one side. I have 12 volts right here. Obviously, if I touch it to the end of the test light, it's going to turn on. Now let's put the diode in line. So remember, AC power. So you can transfer power from anode to cathode. This would be backwards from the diagram. More like that. Anode's on this side. I'm going to supply power to this side. Now if I touch my test light, it's going to turn on. So if I hook the diode through a ground, it's going to be cathode. To anode and what do you know the light turns on so like I said the main reason we use a diode in car audio is to isolate one circuit from another another use for a diode can be to drop voltage so if I show this on my meter right now we're gonna see it is at 15.64 volts, but if I run it through a diode, I drop roughly half a volt. So if you series a bunch of diodes together, you can keep on dropping. It would take a lot of diodes to get to like five volts if that's what you were trying to do. It'd be much simpler to buy a circuit designed to do that, like a pack audio piece. So that's what we use diodes for. Isolate circuit from another circuit, just like I showed you on the retained accessory power and the latching relay. Any more questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below, and always have a great day.